My name is Francisco Bustamante. I was born in Tarlac City, Manila, Philippines. And now I'm uh, 51 years old. I have uh, four sisters, and I'm only the man in my family. They all married. They have a lot of children. I have children. And my father, he worked in the farm. And my mother is a housewife. I had three dogs, but uh, they very uh, unlucky. They die. That's why right now I don't have dogs. I just have the, uh, my kids, my six kids. I have four boys and two girls. The, the older is 31 years old. The youngest is nine years old. I'm only the one in the family I play pool. Nobody, uh, nobody play pool. Just, just only me. Supposed to be the uh, second younger, junior. He loved, he loved to play pool, but it's not uh, like when I was young. Because when I was 15, I played uh, good playing pool. But uh, my son, I think it's for him, it's only just for fun, but he loves to play pool. I play a lot with him, and sometimes I teach him, he never listen to me. That's why uh, I was thinking maybe he just like to play just for fun. But he always with me together. Every time I go in the pool room, always with me. I meet my wife here in uh, Germany, in uh, Kiel, in north, in west. So I meet her 1991. And then we be together until now. So it's 24 years. We've been together. My wife, she don't play pool. She just cook and uh, pet the children and me. Well, supposed to be if I don't play pool, I'm a uh, farmer guy. I make like, uh, uh, in Philippines, very popular, you make in farm, it's like the rice. It's like it is potato, bread. That's, that's the, uh, I never, uh, I never think in my mind I play pool because this is the I start uh, in farm when I was a kid. My hobby, I just go to the city, uh, shopping with my kids, and sometimes we go to a uh, beach because that's the time I have only with them, because most of the time I'm in uh, uh, trouble. So that's my hobby with my family every time. Well, any, any kind, uh, what they need, what I need, just only looking for a uh, uh, cell, clearance, angibot. That's the best shopping. Angibot. <laughs>
And I play, because in Philippines we play uh, 19, uh, 15 balls. We call rotation. It's like 9 ball, 1 to 15, you know, you have to start from 1, 2, 3. And I can run 10 ball, I was 13 years old. And then, uh, and then I was thinking, oh, I think uh, I like this game, you know. That's why I never stop. Every day I play, day and night. Uh, when I grow up, that's the game I see in Philippines, rotation. They play 1 to 15. We don't have different uh, games, just only rotation. Sometimes we play 8 ball, but not 9 ball, no 10 ball. And then uh, that's the I grow up. I play rotation in rotation because you can learn a lot about the kick shot, about the cue ball, how you're going to work your cue ball. That's why uh, uh, that's my training. Until now, that's my training rotation. I still learning about the kick because in kick shot, all the Filipinos they kick so good. Uh, I stay there the whole day. I start like 10 a.m. and stay there. Sometimes I forgot to eat, and I eat only one time. Only stay in the pool room. My best friend until now is only one, is Efren Bata Reyes. That's the best, best friend never have since 1991. When I meet him in, uh, I know Efren so well, but we never been together. And then I meet him in uh, 1991 in uh, Munich Master. And then I, after that we begin uh, together every tournament. We stay in one place, and we talk, and that's why we become uh, good friends until now. I learn a lot with Efren, uh, but he's not my teacher, he's my idol. But sometimes I look his game, so I learn. And then I ask him, how about this shot, and then he show me. But he's not my teacher, he's my idol. The important is uh, when you play longer the queue, like you have uh, more confidence. You have more confidence because you play longer this queue and you have a uh, good feeling. For me to have a good material like the uh, bear queue, since now, I, until now I play, it's 21 years, years now I play the bear. I mean, it's, I trust him. And uh, always with men play well, you know, and uh, more comfortable. That's why I like, and uh, especially the shop, your regular shop, you know, and I like so much. I can play wherever I want. The best moment in pool career. Uh, 2010 when I win the World uh, Nine Ball Championship. That's the best in my career because I play so so much this uh, title, this tournament, and I never win. I was playing in the final against Strickland. I lost, and I like to have this title because I never win in my life. And uh, and then 2010. And then I have the uh, the title when I play in uh, Qatar, so I be the Chinese guy. That's why uh, I become the uh, I got the title 2010, the World Nine Ball Championship. And then uh, when I got it, so I make big party with my family, with my friend, so everybody happy. And uh, my sponsor Dynamic, they was so happy when I win that. So they make big party for me. Well, everybody know me because everybody uh, uh, they show in TV and everywhere I go, even the small child, they know me. And sometimes they ask me for picture, autograph, so I have to do it every time. And uh, I'm very proud. Every time they ask me for autograph and picture, that's the I feel I'm a superstar in Philippines. Yeah. 
Oh, the worst moment in my career when uh, 2001, when I play uh, Strickland. I play him in the final, and then uh, the worst with me, uh, my daughter, she died, and I play in the final. That's the worst uh, in my life. It's very hard to play when you have a big happen in your life. I heard that uh, that's uh, top 16, and then somebody called from Manila. My daughter, uh, she died, seven months. Supposed to be I don't like to finish that game. I like to uh, default and to fly back to Manila. And then my wife, my sponsor, they call me and my friend. And uh, you can do nothing. All you have to do is just finish the game. You never know, maybe uh, uh, play for your child. And that's why I play until the finals. But in the finals, I have no, I'm very unlucky. And uh, every time uh, I miss, I miss. So it's tough. It's, it's very tough because my mind's in the Philippines, not in this game. That's the worst uh, in my life. Well, it's, it's, more, it's, it's more advantage when you break hard, you know, because it's more, uh, uh, it's not like, it's a lot of different because like my break, before I break so hard and then still uh, my break is so good. That's why it's very hard uh, to beat when you have a break like that. Well, you know, it's a little bit less because my stomach is big, so I cannot break so hard. It's not like before, I'm very thin, so I can break as hard I can. Now it's a little bit less, you know. But still strong, still a lot of power. But I mean, it's, when I was 30, it's more better. I can control uh, the break every time. That's why they scare with me. Every time they play, they scare with me. Your opponent is a little bit scared with you because you win a lot of tournaments. And uh, it's not only like that. You break hard, you know, and you shoot good. So that's why it's, they scare. That's the way it is in pool. When you win a lot of tournaments, everybody is scared with you. Because I'm the, I have a good uh, name, so they scare with my name. But <laughs> maybe. But now it's uh, many young players, they got no respect no more. <laughs> but it's still fighting, that's very important, you're still fighting. And no scare nobody. Well, you know, before you go in, uh, uh, in tournament, in competition, you have to practice a lot of things about the break, about the difficult shot, and then uh, the mentality, the Filipino is always, uh, it's like uh, relaxing. We don't play so much concentration. I mean, we don't like so much play concentration because when you play so much concentration, when you play longer, so you, you, you're gonna lose your uh, uh, mentality your concentration, that's why we play relax. And uh, I learned that with uh, so many good players in Philippines. Just like play your, uh, like you play practice. D don't, not, uh, don't think too much. Well, in the beginning, you can uh, feel nervous because uh, you like to play aggressive in, uh, in the beginning. But and then after a few games, and then it's different. You can feel different. The experience make you more strong. And I always, until now, I always think like that. Just, I play myself. I don't care how good my opponent. I just think I play myself. That is the, the, my uh, mentality. I don't feel a uh, pressure. That's the, uh, my, uh, my experience. Because when you think your opponent is good, and then how are you going to win? You cannot win no more because you put pressure in yourself. 
So, so in my in my experience, when I play the good player, I always thinking I play better than you. That's always like that. And, and then you never scare in your uh, game to win the tournament because, for example, you play the uh, you play the World Pool Championship. This is good title. I was thinking only the title because when you win the title, that's make you proud yourself and make you more strong when you win the tournament. When I was uh, 15, I smoked because I have a lot of friends, they smoke, so they let me smoke. <laughs> so and then I smoke and then uh, even I play, so I got cigarette in my mouth. And then uh, he say, oh, you look, you look like a jungle. Because that time the uh, the movie, the movie uh, Eastern movie, cowboy movie, and sometimes Franco Nero, his name is Django, and always kill people. And uh, that time because it's no it's no rules in pool, so you can do whatever you want. You can smoke with your mouth and keep playing, and it's, they let you play like that in uh, where I was born. So, and then I say, oh, you like like a jungle. And then after that, he mentioned this uh, nickname. Until now, nobody forgot. But this, that's the original, my nickname is Django, not uh, Busti. They call me Busti only when I was in Germany. But uh, original is Django. Well, the best player right now, you know, Shane Van Boming, because every tournament in U.S. he win. And then uh, Dennis Orculio and uh, Carlo Biado, because they're young, you know, and they play in, in the moment, they play so good. And especially the uh, uh, European player, like uh, the I hear uh, Josh Filler, he shoot straight and he's young. And then Nils Payen, he's young, you know, he, he shoot every, every ball too. He's very hot right now. I think in the moment that's the best players right now. Appleton too, Appleton. Because I never mentioned, because I forgot always his name. Well, for me, really, 100%, if without jump cue, that's better for me because I can kick so well, better, better than anybody. I don't like jump cue. I like to play uh, with, uh, with skill because when you play a uh, good shape and then you just use the uh, jump cue and then it bring nothing. So you have to show your uh, how good you are in kick, you know. That's the best before, that's the we play before. But now jump cue is coming, so you, we can do nothing. And uh, we, uh, we are uh, no good in uh, jump cue, that's why we lose every time in jump cue. Yeah, maybe I come back to Germany to uh, teach some people, or maybe, I don't know, maybe I play Liga, I don't know, but for, but for sure, 90% I come back in Germany. Because uh, my family, they live here, you know. Without my family, I can't live myself. So I have to come, come back here to see my family and play uh, probably a Bundesliga or teach people. Well, supposed to be with my achievement is I'm, be, I'm so happy. Because I win a lot of tournaments, international, and I win the World Pool uh, Championship, so what else? So I got everything except U.S. Open. I never win the U.S. Open, but uh, still fighting. But uh, for my career, I'm so happy right now. I got everything. Yeah, I just want to say uh, thank you for the uh, Dynamic Billiard Organization. Uh, 
for sponsoring sponsoring uh, to me in uh, 21 years so without you maybe i cannot play at uh, the uh, all tournament so thank you for uh, helping me and uh, god bless you i hope uh, we keep doing together again for uh, rest of my life so thank you very much again